Now, two million people use them. They are the subject of much debate. A new report this morning. Scientists are hailing e-cigarettes to be far safer than normal cigarettes. Yeah, it's believed they can also help smokers curb their cravings and, in fact, kick the habit altogether. Uh, Charlotte, you've got more details. I have, yeah, because there's been a bit of confusion about this. Unlike previous surveys, this new study looked at the actual levels of nicotine and harmful substances in the body after smoking. Now, the problem with normal cigarettes is that they release addictive nicotine, but also that smoke carries tar and poisonous chemicals into the lungs and it can cause cancer. E-cigarettes use a liquid containing nicotine and flavourings. Because they don't have any of the toxic elements of normal cigarettes, today's new study shows that users had 97% fewer cancerous chemicals in their body. And the researchers say that they hope their findings will reassure those people who want to quit but might have been confused by the mixed messages they've heard so far about the safety of e-cigarettes. Dr Hillary joins us now. Um, so they are safer... But are they a gateway to cigarettes? That's the big concern amongst particularly parents who's, you know, teenagers might. They, they may be. It, it's it's fueling that habit of having something in the in the hand, uh, socially attractive uh, to uh, to children who might think uh, this is uh, something to mm. to be emulated and and copied. However. For those people who are already smoking, and there are 10 million smokers in the UK, mm. this is really good news. This was a long-term study carried out independently at uh, UCL uh, in London, uh, cancer, uh, cancer Research UK funded research, which measured levels of these toxins and carcinogens in saliva and urine of long-term smokers. And they found out that levels uh, were very, very low indeed after six months of using just e-cigarettes mm. or nicotine replacement compared to smoking tobacco. Now, that's really good news because it's even better news than we had from simulated experiments in the past that suggested that e-cigarettes were much safer than smoking tobacco. This confirms it. And because these e-cigarettes contain nicotine, it means that people can get rid of their cravings mm. uh, and give up smoking this way. It all sounds very positive, uh, Hilary, mm. but you're a doctor yourself. I'm sure you're not going to say, absolutely, we advocate e-cigarettes. There is a downfall. The best thing to do is never smoke at all. Never smoke anything. Um, uh, but if, if someone's already smoking and finding it difficult to quit, uh, then nicotine replacement therapy or e-cigarettes is the most popular method of quitting. But the, what the interesting thing coming out of this survey was that if you continue to smoke some tobacco cigarettes whilst trying to do the transfer to e-cigarettes, the effect is not nearly as useful. So you've got to give up the tobacco to move to e-cigarettes if you want the benefits. Yeah. All right, Dr Hillary, thanks very much indeed. Pleasure.